Hello everyone. Um, there's been some activity uh, with er earthquakes over six point uh, near Greece and Tonga. So we want to go into our browser and I'm going to show you uh, what's going on, been going on since the 31st, so the last couple of days. And as you can see, we have a 4-1 in Wyoming. Uh, we don't want to see anything, anything at all, to do with Yellowstone, so that is troublesome. To me it is. And we have a 3.4 right here where I live in Oklahoma, March 31st. A 2.6 in Arkansas, March 31st. We have a 4.4, 31st in Mexico and I, I'll highlight the higher ones and just kind of scan the rest and let you know generally there's a 3.1 in California I'll let you know generally what most of the others were which they're in the 2 range 2.4, 2.6, these are on the 31st 2.4 on the 1st here's a 3.6 on the 31st in California so we see anywhere in the United States from a four, a little over four, down here in Mexico, four four, to a three six. So you have this kind of a, sort of a little triangle here, uh, higher than I'd like to see it, higher than anybody would like to see it. So let's go over the whole globe and see what we can find <clears throat> and what is going on everywhere. And then we have. April 1st, 4.7, Colombia, Panama border region. 4.5, Northern Colombia. We see up here. 3.6 in Puerto Rico. 3.2, Virgin Islands. 3.7, Virgin Islands. And that was April 1st. 4.5 in Argentina, 31st. 4.9 in Bolivia, the 1st. 4.7 in Chile, the 1st, 4.8 in Chile, the 31st, 5.1 in Chile, today. And that was the 28th. Chile had a, uh, let's see, where did that go? 5.1. So they're getting some heavier activity, it looks a little bit to me and we will just scan every piece that we can and see what is going on 4-7 April 2nd Kashmir 4-5 in Afghanistan the 29th 4-8 Afghanistan April 1st 4-6 Tajikistan April 2nd which is today 4.8 Philippines April 2nd 4.9 4.8 the 31st 4.9 the 31st 4.7 in Indonesia oh that would be on April 1st 5.5 5, Papua New Guinea on April 2nd 6.4 here is Fiji and a 4.6 in Tonga on April 1st Fiji, 31st. 4.5, Fiji region, April 1st. 4.7, Fiji region, on the 30th. So they have something going over there too in the in the heaviers, heavier readings. And Hawaii had a 2.1 on the 31st.
and we don't see anything over here right at the moment we'll just turn the world upside down and we have a 4.9 on April 1st in the Western Indian Antarctic Ridge I think we're all getting a bear that no matter where we're looking at and there we go we have our 5.9 in Greece which I have heard that it's been upgraded to a 6.2 so it's, it apparently is a little bit stronger <clears throat> and I just heard that report just uh, within the last hour I have not heard of a tsunami warning or anything like that so we'll just have to keep monitoring the situation and see what is growing or not growing over there uh, I'd like to keep it zoomed and we're back in the United States and I still worry about this because if this blows up there in Yellowstone in that region we don't want that definitely don't want that we've been over the Fiji I think we get the idea of what I'm trying to show is everywhere that we've been looking and there's a tropical storm there also there everywhere that we've been looking they have something going on it seems like every region no matter what there's a 4.7 in China on April 1st and of course we've already been over to Kashmir But no matter where we went, we're seeing activity. And we're seeing it within the last couple of days. You know, I think I went back not very many days. At least within the last three, and most of what we turned over and looked at was from the 31st. So that's only been two. I have checked the solar forecast if I can get any good readings from it and uh, supposedly we're not going to get any X class type action uh, M class was forecast to be moderate um, so something is still belching and turning and grinding and shifting inside of our planet and it appears to be all over the entire planet so I would like everybody to be aware in case you weren't of what's a few days at least uh, we haven't had too many sixes that I've noticed um, so the fact that we've had two uh, this close together you know within two days of each other in a, in a little different region besides Japan well hopefully we won't have to <clears throat> see anything big like a nine or something like that and maybe maybe it will calm down but this is just your earth alert you know you can just go onto earth alert and do the same thing a lot of you probably have a lot of you probably do for those of you that didn't or hadn't you can check it out and you can turn the world around and over and sideways and you can see everything that's going on well something's not right again if it ever was we thought maybe it stabilized for a while 
but I don't think we're going to get that luxury. I think it's going to keep belching and quelching and turning and shaking, rattling and rolling. So I'm praying for everyone that nobody gets hurt in case something else happens somewhere, sometime. And I just wanted to update everyone because I got home and I saw this uh, this activity and I was watching the news and they mentioned about uh, Greece. And so I came on here and, and was looking at everything and I could notice that in different regions of the world it seemed like uh, everybody was getting a, a pretty well a high three or a four or, and now up to in the sixes. So I want everybody to try to be safe and uh, pray to the Lord. Ask Him uh, to forgive your sins and to protect everyone in case of catastrophe that they have to endure. And we hope that it will be longer, but it could come shorter. You never know. Nobody knows. We can only try to be aware of what we think when we know. So, I'm going to close it for now. I just want to leave everyone aware about the uh, pulsation and eruption and the turning and the twisting still produced. And it doesn't appear to be subsiding. So, in the next few days, over the weekend and such, everybody try to be uh, safe and aware. If you got a few minutes, you know, at least get on the computer and whatever site that you you go to to see these things you know check it out for a little while and stay informed it's better to be prepared and safe than you know not paying attention and sorry so I'm gonna go ahead and close it out and I'll keep you informed if I find any any new stuff out I'll come on here and I'll share it with you as quick as I can God bless you and I'll see you later.